It's the season of love, but unfortunately for many of us, those loved ones are not close at hand. Reti looks at the ways tech can help us keep in touch with them. I'm a romantic at heart. And not just when Valentine's Day looms, but all year round. We all know the order of the day is usually chocolates and roses when it comes to romance. But what about the role that tech can play? Just think of something like Skype, the staple to many long distance relationships, allowing lovers to feel like they're right there with each other. But if you're physically together and want to try something to keep the surprise alive, try a shared folder love note. Dropbox is a great option because you can easily create a shared folder that will bring up notifications when there's a new love note. Then write the love note and drop it in. But if that sounds like way too much work, not to worry about it, there are ways that you can send cards online. And one of the better websites that you can use is eGreetings. It's user-friendly and it's free. Just choose your card, add a personal message and send away. Another option is American Greetings. Set up an account and choose from things like talking e-cards where you can either type in a personal message that will be voiced through a character or you can record your own message and send it along. Happy Valentine's Day from the tech report. You can pay up to around $4 a month to $20 a year for this service. But maybe you're just an old school romantic at heart. Well, how about looking into creating and making your very own mixtape? Everyone's Mixtape is a great site that lets you create mixtapes that you can share with your friends. All you have to do is sign up either via Facebook or Google+. Then it's up to you to title your tape, add songs and then share it with your loved one. If teddy bears and flowers aren't your thing, there's no excuse on giving up on keeping the romance alive. And that's great because with tech you can tell that special someone how special they are all year round.